Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science and Independent and Dependent Variables. How are independent and dependent variables different? An independent variable, also called the manipulated variable, has the ability to stand alone. It is not changed by the other variable. It is the variable you are changing or manipulating. The dependent variable, also called the responding variable, depends on the other variable. It is the variable you are me measuring. Let's look at some examples. It is summertime. You would like to know if the color of the car impacts the inside temperature of the car. You find four cars of different colors and park them outside. You measure the inside temperature of each car every 30 minutes for two hours. The color of the car is your independent variable. It will not change based on the outside temperature and you have four different colors. You are changing this variable by choosing the different colors. The change in the temperature inside each car is your dependent variable. It may vary according to the car's color. You will be measuring this variable by taking the temperature inside the car every 30 minutes for two hours. Let's look at a couple other examples. The height of a tree depends on the amount of water it receives. The amount of water the tree receives is the independent variable. And the height of the tree is the dependent variable because it depends on the amount of water it receives. And you are measuring the height of each tree. Another example. Eating five servings of bananas a week reduced the blood pressure of male patients. The number of bananas the men eat each week is your independent variable because it will change. And the blood pressure is the dependent variable and it is what you are measuring. When graphing the independent and dependent variables, you can remember which axis they go on by using dry mix. The D stands for the dependent variable, the R stands for responding variable, and the Y stands for Y axis. The M of mix stands for manipulated, the I stands for independent, and the X stands for X axis. Hope this helps your understanding of independent and dependent variables. Moo Moo Math and Science uploads a new math, science, or motivation video every day. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share.